Hello everyone. I've had this uh, best 7-pin small format interchangeable core lock for, gosh, six months now. Picked it up a while ago and I've been avoiding making a, a video with it because I've only ever been able to pick it to, to control. And I still have yet, despite my sincerest efforts and reading about Zio's technique of forcing these locks to a different shear line, I have still not yet managed to pick it to uh, operating. So I've been holding off on making a video uh, until I can do both, but I'm not going to do that now. I'm going to go ahead and make a video in all probability today. I'll, I'll pick it to control. So I won't feel as though I've completely developed a mastery over these locks until I can choose the, the shear line. I know control is better, uh, generally, if you're trying to pick a lock, it's better. I feel like I should be able to pick it to either. And so these are the keys, control key, obviously, in operating. There's the, uh, there's the control key. And uh, there's the operating. So anyway, uh, let's check it up and see how it goes. Like I said, in all probability, <clears throat> unless I get incredibly lucky, we'll be taking this lock to, uh, to control. I, I seem to be able to pick it pretty reliably to control. Um, seven, six, five, one, two, Seven, six, five seems to already be set. Four, three, two, and it looks like we got one, and there we are. So that's uh, this lock picked to control. And as I said, we'll pull the uh, pull the core out of it. <clears throat> A lot of people are big fans of these best locks. Um, I can see why. Uh, they're nice. They're nicely made, anyway. Um, mine, at least, and I believe, from what I understand most, do not have any security pins in them. And so that's just a little bit disappointing. Um, but it is what it is, and I think probably people see, uh, people see best, and, well, as we know, people don't pick locks for criminal purposes anyway, but uh, when they do see a best, if they are criminal, I'm sure they turn around and run the other way. Okay. And like I said, I'm not going to pull I'm not going to pull the drivers out. I don't have enough confidence in my ability to re-pin this um, and have it still work for me at the end of the day. Uh, typically when people do that, they have a keying annex. Um, it's a special tool for these small format interchangeable core locks, but you can see here at least that it does have seven pins and that uh, I think we're going to find they're all, there's nothing special about them. And, and indeed, the, the drivers are not special either. I, I don't feel any serrations, I don't feel any spools, I don't feel anything. Yeah, so they're all standard pins. But that's a uh, that's as far as I'm going to take this particular lock. Again, um, best seven pin small format and changeable core. Thanks for watching.